What's going on everybody, it's Denmark and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be unveiling the new Next Generation Spectacles by Snapchat. I also wanted to thank the AR team for providing me with the device, so thank you very much. So to start off, we're gonna be looking at some of the specs. So this device is about 134 grams of weight. It has a field of view, which is 26.3 diagonal. Battery life is about 30 minutes. You can charge it up to four times by using the case. The processor is a Snapdragon XR1. You also have two different RGB cameras, a 3D weight guided display, which is about 2000 nits. So it's actually pretty bright. You also have internal speakers, also four different microphones, and lastly, voice controls, touch controls, and hand tracking. So that covers the specs. So let's go ahead and look at the device and see what's inside the box. All right, guys, so here's the box that I received. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take this out, probably just put it right over here. And then we have this thing here that we can, we can basically just open the box with. So I'm just gonna go ahead and open it up, put it right there, and then we'll just rotate it here look and see what's available and so as soon as i get it open there's this case so there's also i'll just put the case right here on the right hand side and then let's see what we have in here we also have a little little manual so this one is basically just to to clean it getting a started guy and i'm sure it's just uh, you know the manual so that's the probably the warranty make sure you don't drop it and then start here this is where you'll go to get it set up. So just put that on the side and then as soon as I open it up, here's the actually USB-C connector and that covers what's in the box. Let's go ahead and get the device open and see what's inside. So this came with a little wrap. Just wanted to save that sound for you so you guys can hear it. And get it open, there we go. Nice, and I think I have it upside down, yep. So if you look at the case, I'm looking about, okay, there we go. So here's the connectivity here, if you guys can see it. There's actually the USB-C port, so that's what this cable is going, to, is going to be for. Normally these devices come with, you know, some kind of a charge, so I'll just go ahead and assume that it has some kind of charge, and this is the beautiful, wow, this is amazing. So the reason I say amazing is because it's really hard to, you know, tell you over the camera, but this, is it feels high quality, it feels like metal. So yeah, this, this is really high quality. So as soon as I open it, it just feels, uh, yeah, this is awesome. So <laughs> I, wish, I wish it could be here so you can, you can also see the device. So I'm just gonna take this plastic out and then take this other one out and then show you the device. So here's the screen. We have the two, remember the two RGB cameras that I was describing at the beginning of the video. And then if I rotate it here, I'm sure there's more, there's a lot of technology in here. There's also like a magnet in here. So I'm sure that that's basically how the case is able to charge. And then obviously, so you can, you know, you, you, you have it comfortable on your, on your eyes. There's also another way here that you can charge it. So also USB-C connector in here, different controls. There's one button in there, another button in here. And then let's just give you the, you know, the pleasure of hearing that. So let's put that on the side. And then, so spectacle branding is in here. And let me see if I can get this one off as well. So get that one off there. So they have a lot of protection just to make sure that when it arrives, it doesn't, obviously it doesn't hurt, it doesn't damage the actual device. So the other thing in here that I see, oh, this is really cool. So if you look at, I'm just gonna put the, the device there. If you look at the case, here's the connectivity that I was telling you to charge it. So we can take that one off as well. And I'm gonna take the other one off here as well. So I thought this was like another set of lenses actually to protect it. So I would assume that this will see, so I'll just put it back and then this will see it right over here. And it's like a magnet, right? So if I take it off, put it back in, it's, it's a magnet and then that's basically how it sits on the device. When I was feeling the device, it feels heavy. And I think the reason for that is because it allow, allowed you to charge a device up to four times. So I think the next thing that I'm gonna do is let's go ahead and take these four as spin and then see how they work. What I'm gonna do is it tells me to go to my settings. So I'm gonna go into settings and then basically press the setting key right there. And then if you go down, you're gonna see that at some point in here, it's going to show you a spectacle. So let me go ahead and, 
and find that option, manage, move public profiles, and then also snap codes and spectacles is an option that it shows in there. So right off the bat, it's gonna tell me if I want to connect via Bluetooth, I'm gonna say yes, because I'm currently wearing the devices. It's also gonna tell you here that you have to enable the, the, also, the actual Bluetooth sharing on the permissions for iOS, which is what I'm currently using. So that's already done, we can go back in here and then make sure you get back into the app. And I think I did that, let me see, make sure. Okay, so I had it disabled, make sure that you enable it too on the operating system. Okay, so to pair the spectacles, you have to press and hold the button on your spectacle for about seven seconds, which is what I'm basically going to be doing. So now it says spectacles are currently connecting. You can see that as soon as I did that, it changed right here on the app. So we're gonna go ahead and do pair. And it's saying connecting to the device. So we'll just wait. So connect your Snapchat account, we can say, and then it's, it'll tell you, it'll give you a code right on the Snap Spectacles. So I'm just gonna say, okay, setting up a Spectacles. Okay, so I'll just connect to the Wi-Fi network in my house, hit connect. Okay, so now we need to enable location data. I'll just say enable, and then pairing is currently complete. And the cool thing with this is now we have access to the Spectacles. So probably can look at some of the lenses that are currently, that are available. If I wanted to test this out, we can also change, you know, the volume here on the spectacles. If I wanted to change the brightness, I could do that. Also, it shows me the battery and also the Wi-Fi connection that I have. I'm gonna show you some of the experiences that are available, specifically one about the solar system. So I'm currently just scrolling through some of the lenses that are available already out of the box. So I'm gonna select the solar system and the clarity on this device, I told you that it had about 2,000 nits, and you can really tell that it's 2,000 nits. I am, I am honestly blown away by this device, specifically with the clarity of the augmented reality 3D objects. So if we wanted to get out of this experience, we can go ahead and go back, and then it's gonna tell me exit. I think I'm gonna keep it as short as this, and then on the next video, we'll look at making our own lenses, and. Again, this was really, really fun. If you guys have any questions about the spectacles, please let me know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe and also hit the bell notification so you can get notified of new videos. Thank you very much, guys.